Oh. Oh, that, that was a cool animation. That did a thousand damage. What is going on, guys? And welcome back to another episode of Ark the Center. Last we left off, we tamed this guy right here, the Barsboldia. This guy was a pain to tame, but at some point I'd like to tame another one because this guy has a saddle that has a built-in cannon on it. So I'd love to be able to see what we can do with this guy. Alright, so in today's episode, I would like to tame something special. I'd like to go into the Redwoods and tame myself a Meraxes. Now, if you don't know, Meraxes is another apex predator like T-Rex, Giga, Spino, Vectospinus, you know, all that crap. Well, the Meraxes is kind of like that. So, we're going to see if we can try to tame them. I know for a fact that they spawn in the Redwoods. I know for a fact that they do. So, we're going to go ahead and see if we can tame one. Now, the thing with these guys, in order to tame them, you basically have to feed them your tames. They have to be on neutral, and they have to be on attack or attack my target. So, I figured we have all these Uterenus eggs. I'm just going to grab, like, I don't know, ten of them? I'll grab ten of these Uterenus eggs. And what we're going to do is take one hatchet and then feed it to... Basically, the, um, Meraxis. Alright, Mufasa, you're coming with me. The RG is also coming with me. Wherever I put the RG. Because we're gonna fly around, see if we can find one. Because we cover more ground with a flyer. And the RG is pretty much the only flyer we have at the moment. And we've got more arrows and whatever. Oh yeah, you've got those cannons. You know, we're going to take those cannons, because I don't think we're going to need them anymore. Simply because we've got the Bars Boldia now. So, yeah. Alright, wait, there's another cannon. Here we go. Alright, we're a little heavy. Let's just bring this back. Alright, and I think we might take the Nothosaurus out. Simply because, you know, give the Dinosuchus a little bit of a break. Yeah, we'll take the... We'll take the Nothosaurus out. Alright, let's head over to the Redwoods. And I'm gonna keep the Pyromane on my shoulder, so when we do find one, I can just use it for bait and whatever. So, with these guys, the Meraxes, you only basically feed it, like, the one Uterinus. So we got ten Uterinus eggs, I don't know how many it's gonna take. I mean, if, if we need more, we can always grab more, but, you know... So yeah, that's basically what you gotta do. So let's dive down here. Maybe jump? There we go. Alright, where's our camp? Where's our camp area? There it is. At least we know we gotta get back to the camp. I, I have a general idea on where this is. So I don't really need like a tracker or anything like that. So Mr. Nothosaurus, you can just go here right now. I'll just leave you here. Alright, now this is where the RG comes in. Alright, let's find a Meraxes. These guys are pretty much anywhere in the Redwoods. They're not overly common, but they're common enough where you can find them with ease. Alright, we do have to watch out for Thylas because they can jump and throw us off the saddle, so... Oh, that is a beautiful Thyla, actually. What level are you? 15. And what level are you? 100. I'm sorry. If it weren't for the fact that you were a 15, I probably would have tamed you. Alright, so like I said, the Meraxes aren't overly common. They're just, you know, common enough where you can find one kind of with ease. I mean, you can also find them in the snow biome. Oh, there's one. It's a 55. Hmm. I kind of want something better than that. Yeah, we, we can do better than that. Definitely better than that. I'm going to kill you just to make room for higher levels. There we go. 
All right, let's continue our search. The first one we find is a 55, which isn't... Okay, let's be honest. It is pretty garbage, but... <sighs> oh, there's one right here. It's a 20. I'm certainly not going for a 20. You can get out of here. I'll let you guys know once I've found a, a high-ish level Maraxes. I do miss having the D-Arc. I really do miss the D-Arc because the D-Arc can fly so much quicker. Well, that's a 145 male spider. Ooh, I kind of like that. Let me ping that real quick. And I don't think we need the Bars Boldia anymore. Alright, we'll, we'll keep that pinged. And we should be good to go. Alright, just so I know where it is. And what level are you? That's a 145 female. Alright, cool. A 145 male and a 145 female. Good to know. We do have that max level female. Hello, Civitherium, level 90. Where were you when I was trying to tame one of you? Hmm. I don't know if they take kibble or not. You know, I'm gonna mark it down. I'm gonna mark it down just so I know tracking tab. I will tame that at some point. The 90 will do with this one. I'm not looking for something. It's not gonna be a fighter or anything. The Maraxes, on the other hand, Yes, I do want it to be a bit of a fighter. So, a 130 or higher will do just fine. Oh, there's a Maraxes. We'll level you. A 25. So we've got a 25. Let me just take you out. That's a beautiful car, though. Also a level 25. Hmm. I'll keep the Carno alive. There's a Carno. Alright, so we've only come across like three or four Maraxes so far. So yeah, like I said, they're not... Oh, I see one right here. A 55. Hmm. Alright, so so far in today's episode, that's the highest we've seen. I'm gonna let that bear harvest it. Oh, he's got three bears. They're all 130. Hmm. There's another one. Please be like a one. Oh, that was lucky. Level 25. 95. Getting better. Not quite what we're looking for, but getting better. We can do way better. Okay, you become temporarily invincible when you do that. Alright, we can definitely do better than that. That Thyla missed me. That was lucky. That was really lucky. All right, let me get on a cliff top so I can save just in case the game crashes. Oh, that's that's a max level Thyla. Let me mark that down on the map without getting caught. Max level Thyla. I'm going to make that mainly red. Except. Let me check your stats. 43 points into health. That... That actually seems really good. Really good. Well, I'll keep you pinged. And we'll have to see what goes on from there. It seems to have really good health, though. Alright, let's continue our search... For a Maraxes. And I think maybe next episode we'll go after a Thyla. I think that's another... Okay, 130. 130. That's that's good enough for me. Alright, 130. So, now that we've acquired it, or located it even, this is where the Shadow Main or Pyro Main comes in. I don't think it should be aggro to me. Can I just hatch one of these eggs real quick? Too cold. Of course it's too cold. <sighs> Alright, let me uh, set up some torches or something. I don't know. Wait, or maybe set it next to the pyro main? You don't produce heat? Change fire stores. We'll set that high. Let's see if you'll hatch now. 
How is that still too cold? How? You'd think you'd be able to hatch this right beside the... It's still too cold. All right, let me go make some torches, I guess. All right, is three campfires enough? Oh, never mind. All right, now with this... Now we want this guy to be on either neutral or attack my target. We're gonna whistle neutral, I believe. All right, we're gonna send the Meraxes over, or the Uterenus over to its death, basically. That's right, come here. Come here. We're gonna let it eat the Uterenus. All right, 11% tamed. All right, I think we just need to do this a few more times. Okay, I'm gonna need you to not chase me. If you could not chase me, then that'd be great. Can I just light up these fires and hatch up the next UD? This is the convenient thing about the pyromane. You can use the pyromane to set the fires. Alright. Alright, you're still too cold. If we need to place more fires down, then we will. Oh, we got twins. Did not want twins, but you know what? That's fine. Set them both on neutral, and then send them to their doom. Hello, Mr. Meraxes. Come over here. That's it. Make sure they're on neutral and not on passive. Beast. All right. He's up to 29% tamed. All right, Meraxes. Look, I don't know what you're attacking, but... Come over here. Hey. Yeah, that's right. Come here. Come here. All right, we're up to 37% tamed. Let me up the gamma so I can see. A little too bright. Okay, I need you to not chase me for a minute. Follow me over to the Meraxes. Hey, buddy. Come here. I got another baby for you to kill. Munch on him. There we go. Alright, 54% tame. Hey, Meraxes. I'm back. Come here, buddy. Alright, we are currently at 76% tamed. Alright, so I guess higher levels are great. Now, we don't want you to die to the flames. We want you to die to the Meraxes, not the flames. Yeah, come on, buddy. That's it. Alright, 90%. I think one more and he should be tamed. You're still chasing me, alright. I need you to not chase me. Anymore. I need to be able to put this egg down. This last egg. That's all I need. Alright, we do have enough. We definitely have enough to tame this guy. Alright, I think he's far enough away where I can put this egg down. This should be the last one. And there we have it. Meraxes has been tamed. Alright. We finally managed to find one after a long time of searching. And yeah, so now where are we? Hmm, I think, all right, let me, let me see if I can find base from here. We'll use the, the pyromane to get back. And we are officially back at base. Home sweet home. We'll leave you here for now. Uh, close the gate, thank you.
Alright, let's check out our Maraxes. This guy's a 130, so it shouldn't have the greatest stats of all time. But it's definitely something anyway. Uh, no, I wanted to ride Mufasa. There we go. Good boy, as always. Alright, let's check out the Maraxi stats. Somewhere quiet. Let's check it in here. So we don't have the storm. Alright, so for stats we've got... Oh, terrible health. 26 points into health? Really? Dude, that's terrible. 30 points into stamina, 35 into oxygen, 28 into into health or food, 38 into weight, 37 into melee. It's got really good melee, but terrible health. Alright, so let me go ahead and make the saddle for this guy, and we'll take it out for a spin. Alright, let's take our Maraxes out for a spin. Oh, what kind of saddle is this? What are those things in the back? Are those supposed to be feathers? What the hell are those things? Huh. Alright, so what are our controls? Left click is a bite. Right click does a directional heavy attack. C is a heal. Left control is a roar. Let's check out the roar first. Not the greatest, but not the worst either. And then you've got, let's see, uh, how much damage do we do? Left click. 343, that's not bad. Not bad at all. Well, 513, 1500 with a headshot. What is the, this do? 700. Not bad. That's a golden chicken. Actually, I kind of want to keep you alive. I'll keep you alive. Alright. This guy's pretty cool, I would say. Pretty powerful. We start off with 5,800 health, but he's got 26 points into health, which is terrible. But he's got really good melee. So, that's good anyway. not hitting the shell will do a lot of damage to this guy. I think we do have a rage mode. If we take enough damage, we'll be in rage mode. Not sure about it, though. You know what? I feel like taking this guy over to the volcano map just to see what we can do. You know? Alright, you know what? We'll take this guy over to the Redwoods. Or not the Redwoods. The uh, Volcano Island. And we'll see what this guy is all about. Alright, here we are. And this is around where we tamed the... The female Pyroman. Alright, let's test you out. Alright, so we've got the Pyroman on our shoulder. So we should be able to be protected from the Pyroman. Alright. We've got a couple raptors. Let's see if we can get this rage mode up. See what kind of rage we do. Come on, make me rage. Make me angry. The T Rex might actually be perfect for us. Alright, we're almost there. We're getting there, we're getting there. And we've entered rage mode. Let's go. What kind of damage do we do? The left click does 590 now with the rage. We're already down to half health. Well, not half health, but you know what I mean. All right, so we've got about 30 seconds of this. I want to see what the stomp does. We do. Oh. Oh, that that was a cool animation. That did a 1,000 damage. A little 140 Pyromane. I kind of don't want to fight a Pyromane. It's a beautiful color. You know what? I might... I don't 
don't know. I might tame it. Not sure, though. Alright, the rage mode has gone away. So, let me look. What, what level is this T-Rex? Level 50? Alright. Let's see what you're all about. How much damage do we do with the bite? 4100. Yep. That's better. Much better. Let's continue to explore a little bit. A 100, and I did see an Alpha Raptor somewhere over here. 57. Alright. There's another Mars Boldy over here. What level is it? That's a 90. Got a couple of Monos. Alright. Yeah, I think that's basically the Maraxis done. Oh, Monos will attack me. Good to know. Carnos won't attack me, but Monos will. Good to know. All right, I think we're all set to go. Ooh, wait, is that a... I think that's an RG. Yeah, that's an RG. I thought that was one of those owl griffins for a second. I'd love to tame one of those. All right, so... Let me look around again, see what else is lurking here. And then we'll, I guess, go from there, and I'll see you guys back at base. And we're back at base. Beautiful base. Alright, so our Maraxes, I don't know where we're gonna put you. We're kinda running out of room. I guess we could throw you over here for now. Yeah, there we go. That's where you could stay. All right, let's go hatch up some more eggs. We're still looking for a 244 Rex and a 211 Vectospinus. All right, let's hatch up our 20 Vectospinus. Remember, we are looking for a 211. Let's see, 211. Still nothing? What about 213? Really, no mutations from any of them. All right, let's see if we have any luck with the Rex eggs. We need a 244 for the Rexes. Alright, 244. Nothing. Really. Alright. I figured, you know, we would try something, you know, but I guess not. We'll let them keep breeding up and whatever, and I'll just come out here, give them their privacy, down the gamma, or lower the gamma. Why are you... Why are you doing that, Rex? Sit up straight like a normal T-Rex. Why are you... Why are you leaned like that? Let's try this. Sit up straight like a normal T-Rex. There we go. I think... I think that's good. Alright, anyway. And with that... That's going to have to wrap it up for this episode. If you enjoyed it, make sure to leave a like and subscribe for more. It would really help out a ton. But until next time, I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.